Hey, what's up everyone? Naki here. I have a pallet expander in my mouth, if I sound a little weird. And we are back on Minecraft. I'm back! I'm back after a long time. I know I uploaded ODSC a while ago, but there's been a lot of stuff going on, especially with this pallet expander, and I, you know, kind of wanted to wait a little bit for another upload, but we are back for my secret DIS project. I already showed some of my friends. Let's kill this pig first, because I don't like how he's looking at me. Ugh. Okay, there we go. Oop. Uh... Anyways, DIS project. Daytona National Speedway. Ooh, look at that. Alright, so we're going to use... Which way should we use? We'll use this way. So first, we're going to go to the main stands. Alright, so here we are. We are at the Sprint Tower, and just look at it. Look at the beauty. This took me about a month and a half, I think. Yeah, a month and a half. So here's the front trial stands. These are actually the most tricky part of the track that I had to work with because I had to figure out a right angle. Here is the fan zone, moving across, pit road, grass area. I'm going to be trying to do a video for this for Achievement Hunter because I just joined as a new member for the website. So I'm going to put a little bit of a Achievement Hunter splash on it. We have the Daytona, uh, Daytona name with the flags, which I really impressed myself with. We have start finish. So I added the road course along with the two different garage areas. The course goes all the way around. You have Rolex. Hold on, let me just get over. <laughs> Bam. Rolex right there with the crown. Then we have all, well, not all, but as many flags as I could. So I wanted, I was thinking of adding more into it, but since it was coming up close and I kind of already got into this, I thought, why not just do a video on it now? Because I, I might add stuff in the future. I'm going to be continuing I'm going to be trying to update this as they add in the new stands. You might notice that the back stretch is not there. I thought it would be a little bit of a waste of time to build it and then destroy it. Because they are removing it. So uh, We'll see how this, th this track goes in the next upcoming time. Now, the interesting thing about this, I looked at a lot of videos on YouTube. YouTube. You hear me how I'm saying YouTube? <laughs> Oh, man. Anyways, I saw a lot of videos, and none of them have banking. I'm really surprised by it. None of the tracks I've seen in Indianapolis, I've seen what looks like Daytona. None of them have banking. So, uh, I'm going to try not to say that word anymore, because I just can't say it. But, I have turns 1 and 2, 3 and 4. I added the uh, tunnel. I actually go enters that over here. I can't find my way back out. We have the bat here. Let's take a drive around it. Mm-hmm. Look at this. If only there was a car mod on the 360 version. Then we could have cars racing around it all the time. Here's the bus stop on the back stretch. I actually go into normal uh, speaking sometimes when it doesn't involve ease. Yeah, doesn't involve it. There's animals on the track! There's animals on the track! Watch out! Okay. And again, let's look at the map, because it covers a large part of the map. Look at that. I have future projects I'm going to be working on. And for it, we're actually going to be looking at this, but... Yeah, it looks pretty good. Let's go high. Ha ha. Alright, so here is the speedway from a top view. So there's the Sprint Tower. And everything else. And... I just It just amazed me how much I can get done in a month. Look at all the road systems. Everything that's there with, I think that's Lake Lloyd. I may be mistaken, but, uh, yeah, I think that's Lake Lloyd. But I added as much as I can. It's not an exact replica of the Speedway, but I did as much as I could. I looked at pictures, I looked at videos, I looked at anything I could to write out. Lake Lloyd is a little bit small, but again, I had to work with size. So, uh, the back stretch is the only one with a gate because it was a little catch fence because it was a little difficult to get it around. The turns turns three uh, tunnel, which is the original, is not even finished because I haven't got to that yet. But I thought, why not just do a video now? We're going around the back. We're going to go up to the Spotters Tower, Sprint Tower, Spotters Tower. I have a ladder up there, and this is where you sit if you are a spotter. And look at that video. If only I just wish Minecraft had a better loading system, or at least on the 360. Because then you could see the whole track. I'm kind of sad about that, but when you get into a certain view, you get to see it. So, let me know what you think about this. 
please put a like on it, uh, this video, and subscribe to my channel for more. More creations will be coming up, so make sure to look that out. Also, I'm going to be wrapping up ODST. I have two more episodes to go. Yep, two more. So, make sure to look out for that. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any cool creations or ideas that are really wacky and nobody really thinks about, because I'm all about that, you can also put a comment down below. Or, if you want, email me at nikegaming at gmail.com. Uh, I would get used to me talking like this, because this is going to go on for a little bit. Can't really say how long, but, you know what? It's funny. It's enjoyable. It's enjoyable to hear me say E. <laughs> AT&T. Anyways, thanks for watching. We're going to end it off looking at the Achievement Hunter symbol on the trial Then slow pan up to the front stretch. Then do a turn, spin around. Grab the pickaxe. And I'll see you later.